So you're saying that someone called Beetlejuice? Don't say his name. If you say his name three times, he will appear. I know this is a big step for you, but in the words of Dr. Glickman, I'm going to give you the push you need. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. <laughs> Is that Beetlejuice? First of all, I want you two kids to know this is a safe space, okay? Feel free to express yourself. Don't be afraid. I sense there's an enabler here, but we'll get to that. You're a figment of my imagination. Really? Is this a figment of your imagination? Oh. Jesus, Bob. Can't you see him concentrating here? You know what? Long distance relationships can be difficult, especially when one of you is dead and the other's ignoring it for 30 years. But Lydia and I, we have a definite psychic connection. And I'll tell you something, she definitely saw me that last time. I feel a little tingle. What? Why? No, no, no! Tamia, what's wrong? Oh, I'm trying to capture the perfect primal scream. I'm going to blow it up, mount it on the wall, and I invite all of you to do the same. Why? For the collective. We cannot sincerely celebrate all that was good about our dearly departed. Not until we release the horror that they inflicted upon us. Oh my God. I was hopefully getting some boxes in town, then I heard you screaming. Are you all right? No, it, it was Delia. Oh, oh Delia. <gasps> I'm good. Ignore her. Who's Beetlejuice? Don't ever say that name. Beetlejuice. Ash and his typical team hates her parent, which is so strange because obviously Lydia is the coolest woman on the planet. Leave me alone. She's dealing with the loss of her father. I think she holds a lot of resentment, so she kind of puts it on her mom. Death is hard. Yeah, sometimes I think life is harder. I felt like I was seeing a younger version of myself, only a hundred times cooler. She's exactly who you would expect the child of Lydia needs to be. Pain and suffering are always inevitable. Where have you been all my life? It's entertaining to watch Lydia take the same crap from Astrid that I took from Lydia. Astrid! Stop torturing your mother! <laughs> Jenna, she just got the tub. She's so strong comedically. She's tremendous fun. She just brings another perspective to it, and she represents another generation, which is what the movie is about. I feel a little tingle. I was scared of everything when I was younger. I would have recurring nightmares of Beetlejuice, where he would show up and offer me grape juice. I find myself already feeling nostalgic for the experience. This is the coolest thing I'll ever be a part of. <laughs> when you're all driving carpool and banging your Pilates instructors to fill the empty voids in your life, We'll see who gets the last laugh. My mom grew up here. That old house on the hill. Wait, the ghost house? Is your mom Lydia Dietz? Unfortunately. She's a legend. The living, the dead, can they coexist? Now's my chance. Ghosts aren't real. Only gullible people believe that kind of crap. I can't believe I'm doing this. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. <laughs> I need you to help me save my daughter. But how do I know that you're gonna keep your word? I swear on my dead mother's soul. Jeez. Bob, you and the boys stand guard. Nobody gets through. Let's go, honey. I recognize this puss. Never seen that chip before in my life. Or afterlife. Are you doing this? Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. I'm needed upstairs. Bob, hold down the fort. <laughs> your guts. Who wants to go first? All right, I will. See, I'm willing to do the work. You know that thing from my dream? Really more nightmare material. 
Confronting the unknown, conquering your fears, <sighs> there's nothing harder. What the f***? Thank you all for coming to this special occasion, but right now we'd like a little privacy. <laughs> <laughs>